Hello friends, welcome to my channel, a channel for learning simple coding. If you find this video to be helpful, please like, share and subscribe my channel. In this video, we are going to learn one more component of material UI is called a popover component. So let me understand here. So let us understand here what is popover component and how we can use it in material UI. As usual, I have just created a new component. MUI popover and here I have the coding for this we are going to start so just I remove this one and I use here here like this and I just import this layout here save this and here I type MUI popover example so these we have the setting here just to set the layout like this now i take one button so i say button here i say button variant equal to content color of button is secondary and uh, i say on click equal to handle click and uh, i have here show pop over info like this now we can import uh, button also here and i create uh, button also here and I create a const variable test to show set show and I say here use state by default false now I handle the function so I say handle click just arrow function here here we have an event as a parameter I say uh, set show equal to true simple one just we have this variable and we are putting the property to true and we have a show here so now i take one more component is called pop over so i say pop over like this and inside this i take typography here i say uh, body to to display text it doesn't require color and i say here I can say a padding if it is working so padding equal to 2 and here I just display this is pop over component info okay save this now I have to specify when to open this for that I have a open property so I say open equal to show because whenever we make this open as a true show as a true so that's why I can give here information that not show like this. So if we run it, you will see I click on this and some information is coming here. This is popover component info. Remember that now a screen is freeze because it display over the button and over the screen. So we have to click somewhere else for removing this like that. You see, you are not able to remove this right now you see so why it is happening because i have to provide here on close also i say on close and that should be close for that what i do i just specify here handle close function so that function i need to create copy this and here paste it and here i say that close equal to false save this and here i set close no need of this event so you see when i click it open if i click somewhere else it close automatically because now we have a close function also we have a open property also you see now but you see that if i change the position of a button for example i say that my button uh, margin from the x side is 100 pixel like this you see I just set to minimum 10 pixel you see we have a button here I increase little bit more I say 20 pixel here I click here but you see this popover component is just displaying on top of the screen but not over this button I want to display over this button for that we have to put anchor property of this we have to specify the reference of the button so how i can provide for that we have 
anchor property and pop over this is a pop over component here we have a anchor property anchor el and here i need to specify the object or a reference over which i want to display this pop over so that should be anchor object so i say anchor object here or i can say anchor el object but where is this object and how we can control this so in place of this show i can use it as a anchor el and i say set anchor el and here i pass first of all null and in place of this i use this event and here i pass the object of the current event dot current target so this it should be the set anchor el like that whenever i want to close it so i say set anchor el to null remember that this thing here so i say null it and i say uh, show it by using the button reference so it will display over a button now what i do here in place of show i need to pass a boolean function and that boolean fun function i should use anchor here so this if we have a object in this anchor then its property will be true it will display and it will close by dereferencing and it will display over the button because we are providing here the reference of the button so if you see now i click on this and it is displaying over a button you see but we want to give it a position where it should be display not over the button it may be the top of the button in the left and right side of the button for that for that we have here anchor origin attributes of property anchor origin and here i provide vertical vertical position so i say vertically i want it to the uh, center and then we say horizontal and horizontal should be to the uh, right side of the element save this now because it's a object so i should define inside this one save this now you see i click on this and it is displaying just after the right of this you see i have given the position here right and center i can say right and top save this and you see right now it's on top of and right if i want to say left side so it can go to left also i say left side you see now it is on top of this because we have decide here top so here i say to the bottom bottom left you see bottom left so we can specify position and if we want to change some position to the left right or some center for that we have one more property is called transform origin so i copy paste and i change it to the transform <coughs> transform origin and here you see if i say we i am giving here top and left here also top and left so it will transform the location you see you see it transform to the over of this so i say i want this to the uh, i say here uh, top of the screen you see and uh, i say here to the right side of this to the bottom and you see we have this side and if i remove this origin here now you see the position you see position is just down of this button but if i set the transform property here you see it will go to the bottom and top of the screen right now you see it shift to the top of the screen so like that you can change the position by combination of these two property and remember that it is pop over so that means this display over a screen and it close all the other activity of the screen because it just waiting for the response similar to this component we have one more component that is called popper the popper component is just display information like a pop up over a component but it does not hold the screen 
like this pop over is holding the screen and taking for the response if i click somewhere else it will remove then i can do anything on this screen so if you want to if you want to freeze the response then you can use pop over but if you just want to uh, display information as a pop up and don't want to freeze the activity then you can use popper also so how you can use popper that we are going to learn in the uh, next video if you like this video if you learn something please do subscribe thank you for watching this video mm -hmm.